up, what's up guys? We got some trimming to do today. We're headed about 15 minutes from the house and we gotta trim the shrubs, cut a few things back, a few of the bigger things. Um, it's all the way around the house, the pool, and the garage. So there's quite a bit of it and we also gotta throw down a little bit of mulch once we get everything cleaned up and see exactly what needs to be mulched. And we may have to grab a little bit of rock too, so we're not exactly sure on the mulch and the rock yet. And then if we get that done, we're gonna have to go mow a couple more, mow two little ones, and do a cleanup. But I don't know if we're gonna have time for that or not. We'll just have to see what happens. All right, we just pulled up. Let's check it out. And we got all this stuff in the front here. Trim that, try to get that off the sidewalk a little bit. Trim that liriope. Around that, get it off the house, liriope. Got some hollies over there in the corner. A couple boxwoods here, a few more hollies. Uh, we cut a lot off of that tree last year, so another holly, barberry, a couple, another barberry and holly. We cut these crepe myrtles off at the ground last year, or not last year, two years ago. This tree right here, she said she can't see the lake anymore, so she wants that cut up. So I'm gonna raise that up so they can see the lake. These. We always just level about with the fence, so take a little bit off those. Foot or so, trim these few here. This tree the same way, we're gonna take some off of that. A few more boxwoods over here. And then up there, you got some more crepe myrtles. That's about it. Let's get to work. All right, so I want to show you guys the tools we brought today. Um, we got a trash can, a bunch of rakes, shovels. We got the BR600, the BR700, the HS46C, and then we got the combi here, the KM110R. We got our MS170, our MS250, and a wheelbarrow, and of course, the radio. talking about doing some mulch and some rock that's not gonna happen we just don't have enough time today um, that was something we were supposed to talk about whenever she, whenever I got here and she wasn't able to be here whenever I got here so I'm just gonna have to call her and let her know that we're gonna have to do that another day um, not a big deal but like I said we just don't have time today we're gonna go get those other two cut and get that cleanup done so let's go get some lunch and then let's get that stuff taken care of got me a beefy five layer burrito And a quesadilla. What'd you get? Uh, limited edition triple double crunch wrap. Limited edition, that's what I'm talking about. All right guys, we ate lunch. We're at 
first cleanup we got to do. Uh, there's not much here. It's a lot of gumballs and just a few sticks and things. But I mean, you can you can see here. There's there's really not much. There's a few leaves and there's gumballs. That's a gumball tree. So it drops a few, but he's already cleaned them up a couple of times. So not too bad. But we're just gonna go over it with the blowers and pick up all the big sticks. Throw all that stuff in the trailer and get out of here. All right, guys, we're having a crazy day today. Uh, we got that cleanup done. I was hoping to get some footage of that, show you guys what was going on, but they actually added some. They added another side of the yard. We were only supposed to do the front, and we ended up doing the other side and part of the back as well. This day is not going as planned. The push mower quit running. Um, don't know what's going on. That's the only one we have and we have to use it for these other ones we need to mow. And there's a 90% chance of rain tomorrow. So Nick's got to go. I'm going to do a little experiment. We're going to buy the cheapest push mower that we can find and see how long it lasts us. We, need, we want a bagger. We want small wheels. We want side discharge as well with the bagger so we can open it up if we need to. And that's about it. We don't want self propel because that makes them heavier. Um, we were just going to get something real, real flimsy and cheap and see if we can get a couple years out of it. So here we go. Let's go get a mower. Well, this looks like this is going to be the new mower. All right, so you've seen our sweet new mower, um, but unfortunately, and because of time restraints, we weren't able to get any footage of the last two mowing jobs. They were just push mowing. One is just a really hilly area. Um, the front yard just got a lot of dips and things in it, so we push mow that. And then the other one is just really, really small. It's like a thousand square feet probably, um, if that, maybe not even that. Um, so we just push mode those two not a big deal as always. Thanks for watching guys If you're not follow us on Instagram, you should be check us out Nickens Lawn and Landscape till next time